Yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video on the channel. My name is Technomite. Today's video will be just going over how to make some really cool epic thumbnails in Photoshop. This is a Photoshop version, but I'll also be doing a thumbnail tutorial, non-Photoshop version for non-Photoshop users. But anyways, let's get started for this tutorial. First off, choose File, New, and then choose out the resolution out to be 1280 by 720. And I want to create up some text right here. So I'm going to uh, type the text, make a pick. The font I'm using is called Plump, which is a really great font. Uh, Control T to resize and hold Shift while resizing. Place the text somewhere in here. Make another layer. I'm going to type here thumbnails. Okay, try to limit thumbnails as much as possible. Try to put in as less words as possible. Do the same thing. Place right here. Now I'm gonna go right click blending options and add up a, a nice stroke here. We're gonna make the stroke out of be black. Okay. Do the same thing here. Blending options. Stroke. Make the stroke black. Go to gradient overlay. And put up a nice gradient overlay over it. Okay. Now we need some background for ourselves, so go to File, Place Linked, and choose out background for yourself. Place it in the bottom. There you have it. Nice and cool. We want to choose both of these and make it a big, bigger. Place somewhere in here. That's better. Now when both of these are selected, I want you guys to uh, like type here Control G on your keyboard to group them together. Now we're gonna actually bring both of these closer by like this. Okay. Now I want you guys to create up a new layer over here. Okay. So put it outside the group. Choose the brush tool by pressing a B and choose out black. So you want to fill out these spaces, choose the layer, you want to fill out these spaces that have actually been left. Okay guys, once done, it should look something like this. And now I want to right click on the group, blending options. Over here, choose stroke again, but this time we're going to add up a white stroke, which looks super awesome. Instead of 18, I'm going to choose 14. Uh, yeah, 14. And I'm going to add a drop shadow here of black. I'm gonna reduce the spread up a bit or make the spread up somewhere here and reduce up the size a little bit. So that gives us this kind of effect which looks super duper awesome. We're gonna uh, choose both of them and like rotate them over here a little bit to make them a little bit awesome. We can also go over here into hue and saturation and maybe make it a little bit darker so actually the thumbnail shows out more better okay so that was pretty much it guys for this tutorial this kind of effect is called mlab thumbnail tutorials because these are actually created by mlab a youtuber himself you can check out his channel um yeah that was pretty much it guys for this tutorial hope you enjoyed this if you did make sure to leave like below as always my name is technomite i'll see you next time